Hi, I'm Paul Heaney, Editorial Director for Design World. And I'm Mary Gannon, Senior Editor with Design World. We've got a big box here today. We have it pre-cut because uh, I don't think they'll trust us on, on camera with uh, scissors or knives. So <laughs> let's, let's check it out, Mary, see what we've got in cool. here. Let's see what's we've got going on. Something big, for sure. Yes. So these are air actuators uh, for, pneumatic actu for pneumatic applications from Conti Tech. Pretty cool uh, components here. Let's grab one. These are kind of large. This is, this is one of the Model C. Uh, these have... Um, uh, the, these are the permanently mounted ones. Oh, yes. Um, gotcha. The parts are permanently mounted, so you can't remove them. All right. And that's a three bellows type. Three bellows type. And I think probably a, li a little brother here. And this, I think, is the, the, model. Is the model D. And these have, you know, uh, the removable parts. And air actuators in general, um, these don't have a piston as part of them, so they obviously have a much more compact size, Mary. Right, absolutely. Let's see, what else we got in here? Oh, we got a small one. This right. would be the, uh, okay. is that the Model R? I believe so. Model R. Uh, and, and the sizes here range a lot. I mean, you remember yes, absolutely. we were at IFP show uh, a year about or two ago. About a year ago, and they were, you could practically stand on it. It was probably almost could. as tall as me. Yes. But this is really small, this one. Um, and, and that one has a bead ring connecting point. Parts. Okay. So these are, that's the three differences between those besides their sizes, obviously. Sure. And uh, finally, what There's else we got more, in here? Yeah. We've got, ooh, I've never seen one of these before. That is a lobe ring. Mm -hmm. Lobe actuator, correct? Okay, yes. I've and never seen one of those in person. Is that the Series S, I yes, think? Yes, the Series S. Okay. And you know, a, a lot of these air actuators, they started off kind of in, in mobile type applications and eventually they've moved into more of the uh, industrial automation. Uh, Mary, why, why would you use these, would you, would you say? I, I mean, I think most of the time, especially in the vehicles, they were used for vibration, sure. isolations, and shock absorbing. But they're also used, you know, for tensioning and things like that as mm -hmm. well. So uh, let's, let's look at these friction. a little bit more in depth. Yeah. All right, let's uh, get these organized. These Conti Tech air actuators are available for pneumatic applications from 0 0.5 to 44 kilonewton lifting power with diameters from 60 to 90 millimeters. Now, in addition to allowing compact construction, they can also be used for lift angles up to 30 degrees, allowing for uh, simpler articulate construction. Their elastomer bellows and then the steel top plates and beads are resistant to a variety of media, including compressed air containing oil, dust and dirt, some cleaning agents, glycol-based hydraulic fluids, and even other environmental conditions. They can work with compressed air, nitrogen, and water and water containing glycol. Here, the, the Model C series is available in single convolution bellows from 50 to 115 millimeters and 145 to 405 millimeter diameters. Over here, uh, also available in single convolution bellows, the D series ranges in height from 50 to 120 millimeters and diameters from 80 to 120 millimeters. The R series is also a single uh, convolution bellows design with sizes ranging from 51 to 140 millimeters in height and 442 to 950 millimeters in diameter. And then the smaller S series is available in heights from 30 to 95 millimeters and diameters from 60 to 173 millimeters. Special types include the Eco Design, which is resistant to minerals and fuels, the Niro Design, which features stainless steel connecting parts, and the HP for high pressure applications to 12 or upon request 16 bar. Mary, thanks for joining me and uh, checking out what's in the box. Cool. As always, you can check out all of our videos online at www.designworldonline.com. Thank you. Thank you.